Pisces hello welcome back to my channel I hope everybody is doing well all right Pisces we're gonna go ahead and get into an energy check-in for you we're gonna see what is the most important for you to know at this time although you are Pisces this still could not be your reading okay so take what resonates leave the rest it's general it's collective I don't choose the message okay I just read the cards Pisces okay so keep that in mind if you want extra exclusive content that is on Patreon the link to Patreon is below okay it's exclusive it's ad free as well and they get a lot of content monthly all right um the only way to book a personal reading with me is the email address in my description box okay make sure you check all your placements pisces rose and genders can be flipped around if you're new here welcome if you're returning thank you for the love and the support you are appreciated all right thank you thank you all right what's going on with pisces spirit What's going on with Pisces, 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 Wheel of Fortune. All right. With the four. What? The four ones with the lovers? All right. Let's see what's going on. You got the devil card here. Okay. What's going on with Pisces? I ain't Pisces. What's up with you? Could be dealing with a Capricorn or a Sagittarius. You got the Nine of Wands. Somebody is obsessed. Look like they could be a little mad. You got the Magician here or scared. You got the Ace of uh, Pentacles with the Eight of Pentacles. Something could deal with some kind of, I don't know. Somebody could be doing like some money manifestation. I, I don't know. You got the Ten of Pentacles. Why am I hearing? Why am I hearing? Uh, shake it like a soul shaker in my head. What the freak? What y'all doing? Ooh. Okay. Uh, anyway, what's going on with Pisces? Yeah, it looks like the Ten of Pentacles is out here. Somebody could be doing some money manifestations, or it's something faded to to be very abundant for you. Pisces, you got the king of pentacles. Look at this with the nine of pentacles. Wow. Oh, wow. Six of pentacles. Mm -hmm. Was really good. Was really good. You got the queen of cups with the world card. Okay. What's going on? You got the Ace of Wands. What's really going on with Pisces? Pisces, this ain't bad at all. It just looks like somebody mad in here, though, somewhere. Mad and toxic. And they like to listen to the Yin Yang Twins, obviously. Okay, you got uh, Page of Wands. Queen of Wands. Three of, yeah, Three of Swords, Three of Cups, Three of Wands. Wow, three, three, three. Back to back. Y'all could be seeing 333 a lot. Something deals with like a chick. You got the star card. The four of wands. Four of cups. You could be seeing numbers with double fours in them. Or the number 44 could be significant to some of you. Eight of cups with the seven of swords. Somebody's sneaking off. Hmm. Very interesting. Well, um, seven of swords, seven of wands. You could be seeing numbers with double sevens in them as well. Something's taking a while. I feel like some of you are um reconciling. I do. And this could be with someone that you used to like. For some of you, you were married to this energy. Or you were, I mean, maybe you're going to get married in this lifetime. I mean, you've known this person before. It's like a past life soulmate energy. You got the temperance with the eight of cups. Four of cups. Somebody's leaving here.
So it looks like somebody could be fated to send you a message, Pisces, or you're, you're sending this message or receiving this message. There's just some kind of message out here. Whatever this is, is, is fated to come in, okay? Um, this is your 10 for some of you, okay? Somebody could have a significant Capricorn placement, whoever this is, Pisces. But somebody is your balance, okay? They're coming to bring you some kind of balance. You've manifested this person. They're showing up in physical form. Wow. Very interesting. This is very interesting, Pisces. Very interesting. I mean, put yourself on the side of the wheel that you go on. Somebody has good karma. Somebody has an abundance of bad karma. Somebody getting beat upside the head by somebody's ancestor and the devil. And they spirit babies and they angels. <laughs> like whoever was trying to manipulate uh, something in regards to your abundance like now it's like their turn and they like bouncing on this person's head yeah somebody's having it bad right now something could have something to do with someone who has a Taurus moon specifically okay um, yeah, it's something going on here. Mm. Somebody's leaving. This could be some the mother of somebody's children. <clears throat> they could have Taurus or Sagittarius and or Sagittarius highly aspected. Something could also have something to do with someone who has a Sagittarius child. Something also has something to do with the, someone who's rich and famous. Yeah. So this could be the this could be the the mother of somebody's child who's rich and famous. Like the the masculine energy is rich and famous, and then there's somebody uh, feminine that. So something could have something to do with that. Somebody's been trying to play miss manipulate. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, let me get one on the Wheel of Fortune. Anyway, whatever this is, it's faded. Nothing's going to stop it. Wheel of Fortune. Why is it here for Pisces? We also have Aquarius out here. Pisces and Capricorn energy. Take it how it resonates. Page of Swords. Look at that with the Hierophant. Something could have something to do with the Taurus child as well. Yeah, but it looks like somebody here, somebody's getting karma and it's it's going to be fast too. Yeah, something has something to do with, something has something to do with somebody trying to get some kind of, this is somebody who loves to run and go get like spiritual work done or something like that of the sort. So basically this is just confirmation. Like somebody's, somebody is with someone who is in the limelight but they're the person that they're with is like they're either angry and a tyrant if like it's basically like the person can't like that you did they just can't detach from the person like something could have something to do with a capricorn child there's a couple children out here now but somebody is just kind of just yeah i don't know like they just, i don't let me get one on the devil card it's just a strong grip here. I just seen the Ten of Swords. Like, it's like, what the freak is going on? The devil? Why is this here for Pis Pisces? Nah, this could be great, actually. But, you know, you got to read in between the lines. <laughs> anyway, uh, something would be a good idea for somebody to, like, kind of give something, like, a pause, a break, put up a boundary. Stream card. The high priest is the seven of wands. So something for one is going to be a backfire. Eight of cups. So somebody is leaving because of a backfire. Yeah. The temperance. The sun. 
the star, the judgment, <laughs> the magician is going right back to where it came from. And look at that. The loss is here. That that new beginning, that loss is right here with the whoever this is manipulating energy. Mm -hmm. Or trying to. <laughs> or trying to because they're obsessed. Oh, quit. Mm -hmm. Let me get one on the magician. Why is this here for Pisces? Pisces, this is a big reader. The magician, you got a lot. I just seen the Ten of Swords again. Let me get one on the magician for Pisces. Mm -mm. Whoever manipulates some. It doesn't matter. It could be a feminine or a masculine, but I, I'm getting something specifically about somebody who just somebody's baby father is in the spotlight and they like, please, let's stay together. We got a kid. Not only let's stay together, but let's have another one. Let's do this. Let's do that. But it's like they're not aligned. Like it this is like the type of energy where if you didn't fool around and fool around and have a kid with a person you wouldn't be with the person at all the relationship would have phased out by now let me get one on the magician yeah that's what this is somebody playing you got the six of wands somebody's in the public eye three of swords so whatever this is something could be taking place publicly something could have something to do with condolences or something like that of the sort for some of you this is just be who you share children with Somebody's been trying to hold you back. They don't want you to leave. They're very controlling. Whoever this is, very toxic. Look at this two of swords. They just don't see you leaving. Two of swords, two of pentacles. They like, who finna have a new beginning? Not you. <laughs> like, that's how somebody feels. Yeah, but something has something to do with someone who just wants you to feel hurt because they're hurt. Somebody here is like a grown person, but they like a child inside. They like a sad child inside, whoever this is, because they need that. It's some kind of balance here. Somebody needs to temper themselves. They're not tempered. Or they just don't have no chill. And that's why something's kicking right back to them. Because for one, somebody's stronger than them. Whoever they trying to send work to. What are you doing? It's unfortunate, but somebody is definitely leaving 100%. Or they're just going to leave you alone because they... They don't want it to be too tragic, but I told you I keep seeing the Ten of Swords. I keep seeing it. Clarify this temperance. Yeah. Something's going to happen publicly, though. Like, you'll be able to see whatever this is online, on the blogs, on the internet, in the paper, on the news, whatever. Whatever this karma is, is going to be broadly displayed on a pedestal, Okay. Let me get one on the temperance, please. The temperance for Pisces. The seven of swords. Yeah, don't don't know who this this yeah, this too much. With the six of cups. So something has something to do with somebody who may have whatever this is, this burden that they may have tried to place upon you, or whatever they did to you, it could be past related, but you know nothing goes unaccounted for. So no matter how old it is, maybe they wanted to straighten up and fly right, but we done seen the page of cups a couple times. Maybe they ain't got around to really telling you like, hey, I'm sorry for that time I tried to lay you out or burden your life. Yeah, or stop your new beginning. Yeah, or want to be you, like trade places with you, two of pentacles. Yeah, look at this, three of pentacles or be a third party in your relationship purposely just to try to... I don't know make you cry or confuse your masculine or confuse your feminine my bad like okay well very interesting <sighs> confidently lost by Sabrina Claudio is on let me get one on the on the star <laughs> somebody trying to get away with something the star eight of wands like I said whatever this communication is you're gonna get this communication it could I'm telling you Something has something to do with something that's found that's heartbreaking. Okay. Um, somebody's receiving some kind of communication that is heartbreaking. It's sad. Yeah. It's sad. Let me get one on it, but whatever it is, the justice card is right here with the Ten of Pentacles. Somebody sitting up here want to play with your generational wealth. This communication could be in regards to a child for some people. Let me get one on the Ace of Wands. 
So this could be somebody communicating something. Now this child doesn't have to be an actual child. It could just be like a young adult. Somebody could be just childish. Okay, let me get one on the Ace of Wands, but something is heartbreaking. Ace of Wands, thank you. The Knight of Wands, the Sun. So some of you could have somebody who's strategically trying to find a way to get to you off, off of the other stuff. Off of the other stuff. Because like I said, this is a beautiful spread, Pisces. Just depending on how you read it. Some people read in between the lines. But yeah, whatever this is, something is beautiful. You got the Sun card, the Star card, the Page of Cups here. Something is just meant for, you know, it looks like somebody could just like you. They like you. They, I mean, somebody is very intuitive, highly intuitive here. Somebody views you as a star. They like what they see. A very tempered energy. <laughs> somebody, somebody thinks you're just very smooth or something like that. Um, and you're bound to be successful. Or this is someone who is in the public eye that views you this way. Take it how it resonates. Somebody is fated to just pop across somebody else's timeline. And that's just the way it goes. Because what the ancestors want, they going to do. And it don't matter. You feel me? Something is something has something to do with something that's coming from the heavens. Something is literally, with this right here, something is literally heaven sent. Okay? You got the message right here. A couple of messages. Some, like some of you may have a choice to make it looks like with the two of wands out here. It's heaven sent. Whatever you're getting is heaven sent. It's sent from heaven. Okay? Um, but make sure you discern the energy. Check the fruit. Because somebody out here, one of your choices is very toxic. Okay? It's very, they're very toxic. They're very manipulative. Uh, they just want to see what they can run off with. They just want that, that energy that you have. Somebody's energy and somebody's essence. It's, it's like it's... So some of y'all could just be getting new incoming. One of these people incoming could just be, um, you know, uh, another roundabout with a narcissist. You just got to, you know, just make sure you're paying attention to all the signs, Pisces. You will know who's who. But somebody could just think they could just manipulate you or try to, you know, I don't know what they're trying to do. But... Yeah, you're going to receive confirmation of whatever this is. You're fated to. You'll just see signs and synchronicity. Some of y'all are going to see a lot of signs. Like, y'all are going to have so many, like, telltale, like, you're going to know, like, they were sent by the heavens. But it's not going to be, because like I said in the, whose reading was that? Go back and watch the Taurus reading where I said this would be almost blatantly obvious. Because they're going to, something's going to stick out like a sore thumb like just to just to let you know like eh, 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 you might need to put your guard up watch closely pay attention to what this person telling you because this could very well be someone uh trying to run off on you with the angel and the in the in the devil out here y'all already know it's 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 you're gonna have to battle something okay it's light and dark right here you know uh but one, this could be definitely be like two angelic energies meant to link up. But there's going to be a devil that comes in between that you're going to have to choose between. Okay. So you got to you gotta slay that demon. And then you're going to have, you know, this is a big, this is huge. Whatever this is, it's a huge, huge, whatever it is. Um, Leo, Sagittarius, Taurus, Aquarius, Capricorn, Gemini. Okay, take it how it resonates. Please be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, bye.